Hey there! So today I'm gonna change my bass strings, but it's a special day because it's the first time I'm gonna try the Elixir bass strings. And uh, I'm not affiliated with them in any way, by the way, but I really wanted to try them because I think they solve a the problem that I've been having uh, with my strings for a little while. So right now I currently have on uh, the Dario Nickel Wand strings, which uh, sound great. Like I love the way they sound, especially the first couple days. They are really bright. They got that zinc to it, which is really funky. I love it. Uh, but it just gets a bit more dull with time. Like even after a week for me, it, it just sounds more round as well. So I guess it's what some people look for. But really like for what I play, I really want that brightness uh, of the first couple days that like really new strings have. And uh, hopefully, the, those ones, they are thinly coated, which is supposed to help preserve the tone much longer. So we're gonna see what they're made of. But before I do that, I wanted to do a little comparison. So I'm gonna play a, a funky riff, like a bit of a mix of finger style and slap, so we can compare the tone of both styles. Uh, I'm gonna play it on the current strings that I have. So they've been on for like two months, so they're not, they're not dead at all, but they don't have that very new tone again. But we'll see what they sound like, like they still sound decent. Uh, then I actually found a technique on YouTube which consists of uh, slapping the strings to get back the tone. Sounds kind of crazy, but it, it does work amazingly. Like slapping not an, as actual playing slap, but really like you, you just pull the strings like this. I'm not gonna do it right now because it's gonna sound like shit. But uh, like maybe you loosen even the strings before you do it and it helps for, for me for a couple hours recovering that new tone a little bit. Like it doesn't go all the way there, but it's like a big improvement still. So I'm gonna do that as well and play the same thing to be able to compare. And at the end, I'm gonna put on those strings and play the same thing again so we can compare the tone. So let's get to it. Okay, so that was the first take. Uh, now I'm gonna slap the strings and we'll see the difference. Okay, so that's it for the whole strings. What did you think of the tone? I think it sounds much better after slapping the strings. Still not like brand new, but still much better. So now it's time to test the Elixir strings.
So that's it for today. And I'm gonna say that I approve the strings. Like it sounds amazing, pretty much the same as uh, the Dadario ones on the first day. And uh, like I've, I basically see no difference, like it's very crisp, it's uh, it got the zing, it's very bright, I love it. Uh, you, can, you can definitely tell the difference when you listen to, to the different takes. So now the main thing is going to be to see if they are going to last as long as they say they are going to last. Uh, so I probably make an update in a couple of weeks or in a month or something like this to see if that, that amazing tone is still there or not. Because uh, the strings are pretty much double the price than the Dadario ones that I used to play with. So I hope it's worth it. Cool, well, thanks, thanks for watching and don't hesitate to subscribe and see you next time.